Hello Summoners and Summonettes, it's Gordon here, and today for our weekly Freaky Friday video. It seems incredibly freaky to me, but apparently it is a thing now. We're playing a Rumble Jungle, so as always, let's go and get right on into it. Picking up the Talisman, the Refillable Potion, as well as the Warden Totem. Hi, I'm Gordon Gullick, have fun coming out. And up against us in the jungle is a Kha'Zix, so hopefully we don't get invaded too early on, just because I'm not aware, honestly, of how great Rumble's clear is early on, but uh, we'll see how it goes here. I was told by one of my friends, you pretty much always want to be overheated on Rumble, it just helps your clear immensely. But uh, before we actually get into the game, I guess just props, mad props to Ishkander, this uh, random Corky that I met. I waited like, I think it was 32 minutes this time for a key to pop, and I ended up actually not even getting mid, and I, or jungle, and I just asked if he'd swap and he was cool with it. So. Thank you to that guy for uh, allowing me to not waste 30 minutes of my life to get there on roll. So, gonna try and keep myself in the danger zone at least while we're clearing here. If not, we wanna definitely overheat though. So, just spamming our flame spitter to get that into an appropriate level of uh, heat for us here. And I think I'm gonna just take it as the same kind of clear that I typically do on my AP junglers here where I go for a uh, half clear of the jungle. I don't like doing full clears. I think it's a... Uh, I don't know if it's possible. It might be possible on Rumble, but uh, I think I'll just stay safe with the half clear here. So I'm gonna go ahead and take my Scrap Shield level 2 here. It's pretty good for negating some damage and uh, maintaining a good heat level as well. I shouldn't turn around actually while I'm fighting these camps. I'm used to trying to kite out camps, but you want to make sure your flame spitter hits the entirety of the camp. So there we go, overheating now, so that'll help us out with our clear pretty easily. This clear is actually pretty healthy. I was surprised how healthy I am right now. Maybe I'll go for a full clear. Alright, let's go ahead and just uh, spit fire, super hot fire on these little rays here, take them out. Ah, uh, lied. I'm actually going to smite this and do half clear and then get the scuttle crab as well. Alright, so we hit level 3, grab our harpoons, which will slow the skull crab here, allowing us to just stick to it a little bit easier. Alright, stun it up. So yeah, I actually, I think I prefer the half clear. I don't know why, I'm just so used to doing it, so I'm going to stick with it. And this will just make sure our bot lane doesn't get cheesed by any uh, Kha'Zix early roamage. Actually, could I come down here? I'm actually going to come down here for a level 3 gank. Oh, the hook just missing. That's actually really, really unlucky for us. But we're going to go in anyways. Alright, let's see if we can uh, force any summoner spells. Okay, do force. No, no, overstepping, overstepping. Alright, so Kha'Zix might take my blue now for me showing here, but we didn't give John a flash, so that's not too bad. No, don't, don't force it. I'm not going to help you. <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and pick up the typical... Other component machete as well as a pink ward, and then we'll try and get those deep vision wards down. Let's go ahead and try and maintain a healthy uh, overheat bar. What is this even called? Yeah, I guess it's just heat. All right, what happened? What are what are we getting pinged for? I'm not sure what the ping was for, but I will. Kazakh's probably gonna be around our. I'd say he'd be around our jungle right now. If I was him, I would definitely be in the vicinity looking to uh, pressure me a little bit here so we'll see where he's at but got blue buff pretty healthy still she has flash but no mana okay well uh, Thresh and I might be able to <coughs> collapse on her here because she's being very greedy trying to keep the wave here and we're gonna force the flash out of her here if not kill her so uh, we'll see and she should still die because I'll save my flash as well beautiful so she's gonna get burnt down and an auto attack nice that was actually a really, really good roam by Thresh. I think I could have killed her regardless, but that definitely secured the kill there. And we did get her flash as well, so that was pretty big. And that'll help us uh, with our, you know, scaling into the game. Pretty much from what I've seen, Rumble Jungle, you go the exact same build you would in top lane, except you just throw a Runic Echo in there as well. So we're going to get that Runic Echo into Sork Shoes, into Haunting Guys, into... Uh, Crystal Scepter Landry's combo. Maybe I won't go straight for the Honey Guys, I might just go straight for the uh, 
Pistol Scepter completion just because we are kind of starved for gold in the jungle. Yeah, Kha'Zix just power farmed. He's already level 5. Alright, there we go. Got that. Do I need to cover mid? No, I don't. Corpy will be back in time, so no big deal there. Your clear is actually impressively healthy here with uh, your scrap shield, your W. So that is uh, very impressive to me here. Let's go ahead and just snag that. And we'll see if we can uh, maybe force something out of this. Alright, she's going in for a little... Oh, she just dinged six. That's so bad for a Corky. He's going to get traded here. Oh, he actually survives. Nice. How did he live? That was almost incredibly unlucky for that Corky. She just dinged six and she was looking for a fight there with her ult. So he barely escapes with the... Okay, he wants to shove by the skin of his teeth. I'm going to go ahead and help him shove here just so he can base again and not be afraid of, you know, the wave being in a poor spot here. There it goes. So he gets to base. Nice. I am level six, so I'm going to go ahead and bring my ultimate down to the bot lane here and see if we can work with this. I guess we'll kill Scuttle Crab while we wait. We do have a smite available to us and we'll uh, keep our heat managed while killing this as well. Alright, we'll just smite it to secure it. I think they went back bot lane, so yeah, not gonna find anything there, unfortunately. Okay, pink ward goes down, doesn't find anything, though. No. Alright, Thresh looking to roam. She does have no flash in the wall, so yeah, that definitely could be a pretty good roam, realistically. Hmm. I don't think I need blue smite. Yeah, this already's dead. That Thresh, ooh, the teleport actually coming out from Vigar. They need to get out. They need to get out. Uh, oh man, unlucky. Can I clip her with an alt actually? It'd be kind of funny if I just randomly uh, alt kill her. She's not gonna path that way. She knows better. Oh, she actually did kind of path poorly. Uh, I could have gone for it and I probably should have gone for it. Oh well. Alright, I'm gonna run it down bot lane because Ezreal is in a 1v2. Maybe they'll try and gank him and we'll see if we can just straight up run it all the way across country and pick up a kill here. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, if she comes to ward right now, we could punish her, but I think it's already warded. Yeah, I'm just gonna take a peek at his blue and it's already cleared. Okay, we're kind of falling behind. We're running around with the, or like a chicken with our head cut off. Corky bringing the package to the bot lane. This should be some, uh, some should be some booty for us. I think they can easily lock him down here. All right, let's go ahead. And, oh, we actually canceled it. <clears throat> canceled the mission. <clears throat> Man, why do I always cough when I'm recorded? All right, got that. Easy peasy. We'll see if Ari goes aggressive onto the Corky here. If she does, I'll be nearby to help him out here and try and uh, do a counter gank. He actually just straight up ran it down bot Oh my god. He just straight up ran it down bot lane. I'm going to go ahead and alt the wave here. I just want to get rid of the wave, not allow her to push at all. And uh, it's free minions for me. And I like free minions. <laughs> Alright. Greatest rumble alt. And I, oh my god, we're rich. We should probably go base and uh, spend all this gold that we have accumulated here. I will go ahead and do just that shortly. I'm going to smite this just to make sure there's nobody nearby, no bug infestation. Alright, let's snag blue buff and then we will look to uh, go base here. Holy moly, this money is crazy. Look at the clear speed actually with not even runic echoes completed. That is disgusting. Alright, I like rumble jungle. This is kind of busted. The only thing I would say is probably not too great is just the fact that early on you can get really really pressured so that's just something to make note of while playing rumble so I'm actually just gonna go for I don't think you need any other smite might as well just get a little bit of vision control down with a uh, green smite here so I'm gonna go for that sounds good to me this guy's probably still dead unfortunately yeah uh, wasted ignite I don't know what that ignite was <laughs> ignite's not gonna save your life pal Alright, let's go ahead and get some vision control down. Thresh is uh, roaming again. Let's see if we can hit her. Hit her with the hook. Oh! Missed the 1-2 hook there. Alright. 
Let's just get this pushed in. And we can go back to our jungle. I don't even care if that hits me. F you, woman. Oh, I kind of care, but not really. <laughs> Alright. Let's go ahead and roast some chickens here. And that's gone. Oh, god, she actually could have stole that pretty easily. Alright, our ult is back up, so let's go ahead and run it down to the bot lane, because I think it shouldn't have any summoner spells, or at least Lelouchin shouldn't. But there's a ward here, so never mind. Oh man, that's so unlucky! What a terrible timing, I hate that. You have your oracles from your chicken buff, and then you show up, and there's literally two seconds left on the ward. Super unlucky. Teemo's gonna die here. Ooh, okay, I lied. I mean, I didn't lie. I thought I lied for a second, but I didn't lie. Alright, can we just start this potentially? I could probably solo it pretty easily, but let's see if the team will be able to rotate and assist me. Gonna go ahead and make sure we're always popping that shield, trying to negate some damage that way. I'd like to try and ensure we get this Drake just so we can uh, kind of punish Kha'Zix for showing top this late into the game. And it looks like they're actually getting Rift Herald, probably. So that is a smart move by the enemy team. Oh, baby, get me in there. Gonna go ahead and throw down the ult, and that's a really damn good ult, actually. Cutting off both the Janna as well as the lotion there. And Janna's gonna get sniped here, and gonna go back and try and help out my boy. Oh, that was a really aggressive move by the, uh, ooh, nice hook. By the Ezreal there. I think he could have lived. Probably could have, should have, would have lived. Kind of unfortunate he died, but I do come up with a double kill in the end, so it's not too bad overall. Yeah, Thresh, Thresh knows what's up. We definitely had that pretty easily there. Oh, Kha'Zix coming over. Trying to do it big, but he's going to get roasted here. He doesn't have his ups, so he should die here still. I'm just going to go ahead and skewer him to death. Burn him alive. What is skewer? What is, <laughs> what is that word? Oh, well. So he instantly kind of one for one, and he's worth a shutdown. So that is definitely not worth it overall for the Kha'Zix there, so... Kind of a misplay by him, but I'll take it. I don't mind a free shutdown kill bait. So we are huge. Let's go ahead and base. Definitely want to pick up those Sork Shoes, and we'll look for components of the Crystal Scepter here as well. Alright, bam. And we're actually just going to buy the fat AP here. I was thinking about mid going Giant's Belt as well as a Amp Tome, but I just want to get the raw damage from that needlessly large rod. We are 5 0 and 0. First time ever, Rumble Jungle. I like it. I love it. And I want some more of it. Oh man, we are farming up a storm too now that we do have the uh, Rinnick Echoes completed. I want to just wait for the uh, Wraiths to spawn. Unless they won't spawn time now. I guess I'll just do my red. I was going to try and get the best of both worlds. Do race while I was waiting for red to spawn. But apparently, not going to happen today. Alright, gonna pick up red, and I'm just gonna go roll it down bot lane again. Our ult's up. This should be just a free plop of the ult, and two kills. So let's see if we can make it happen, baby. Alright, ooh, nice flash engage out of the Thresh. Again, a teleport coming out of the uh, Vigar. Was hoping to maybe burn the Janna before that uh, Vigar teleport got off, but you know what? I don't really care. We got a teleport for my ult, and they're really, really low, so... It's not too bad. Not the end of the world by any means. Oh, this guy's hella low. What the heck? He could look for a one-shot on us, so I guess we have to respect that, but he is dangerously low. This is a really greedy ward for me to kill right now. I could get collapsed on by pretty much their entire squad, but luckily they don't care enough to collapse on me. Is this warded? No, it's not. Oh, baby got caught. Oh, he just suicided by a flash in there. I'm going to kill everybody here. I lied. That's a good John ult. <laughs> I'm going to wait for Corky to show up, and then we're going to try and turn. There's the package. That's exactly what I was waiting for. So there's one. Can we get two? He's burning alive. There's two. And the flash forward a little aggressive by the uh, Corky. He's going to get slammed down. Definitely a little overzealous there on that flash. But you know what? I respect it. All right, just pushing the wave, and we got a dip. Kha'Zix did get a kill up top, so that is kind of... Unlucky. Ari's trying to run it down here, but she's not really going to find anything left over. 
All right, we'll go ahead and buy components for the Crystal Scepter here. Boom, have all the components. So that'll be good once we complete that. Keep them slowed in our ultimate. But uh, we are dishing out the DPS, man. That is something unreal. But uh, yeah, uh, eventually, hopefully we'll get some pressure out of the Tito here. But I mean, it's not that big of a deal that we're getting teleported on. We see it coming, so it's definitely manageable. All right. Clearing up some of my jungle. I need to smite more. I always forget. Normally I play with a red or blue smite, but whenever I take green smite, I always forget that I have, you know, I can free will smite camps here. So that's always my bad on that. All right, all right, picking up one kill. She's gonna have. Oh shit, we got charmed. Oh shit, not good, not good. That was bad by me. Bad flash. I did not see Kazus was there. Oh damn, we all died. Shit. Shit. I don't do shit to her. What is your build? Oh, damn. I did not realize you were super weak, Corky. Hmm. Alright, we're gonna have to... We're gonna have to put on the carry pants this game. Who did I get my shotgun to? Kha'Zix. Damn. He's super fed now. Alright. That's a little worrisome. Uh, oh, well. Alright, let's see if we can get a rip herald potential. Oh, my God. Yeah, this team is just, uh, it's not a good lane for him. Oh my god, he's gonna die again. Okay, I had to flash out. He might still be. Nope, okay. Kazakh's not gonna flash for it. Oh, yeah. Well, we're, we're almost playing a 4v5 this game. He just has no pressure, and he, uh, it's kind of irrelevant at the moment, which is kind of unlucky for us. Alright, uh, he's gonna throw down his slow. Let's go ahead and not. Or, sorry, stun. Let's go ahead and not get stunned by that. Just juking it out there. Clearing the wave. Forcing some damage on him as well. If I don't have my ult up, I pretty much can't do anything. Kha'Zix is here. Clearing the Scuttle Crab, potentially. That's one bad thing about the Rumble, is you just never build any CDR in his kit, so... You've got pretty long uh, timers. Pretty reliant on your ult to change the pace of team fights. so if it's not up, you're not doing too much. Alright, I keep forgetting to swap out my trinket as well. I should have oracles as well, instead of just a sweeper. Alright, let's go ahead and snag these. Is Ari gonna dive? She's threatening a dive. I really just want to help Balin. I feel like they're the only hope at the moment. Yeah, there's a... Oh, that's a cheeky little pink word. I should expect that because I normally put that one down when I play. Alright, let's, let's run it down here. We got our ult coming in hot. They're overstepping. <clears throat> Kha'Zix is probably nearby, though. But uh, let's see if we can do anything. Five seconds on his hook, he says. All right, let's, let's just run it down here. Why not? I'm going to throw the ult across both of them there. This guy's going to burn. See you later. Can we pick up the one for two special? Nope. Good monsoon disengaging us. But, again, easy, easy peasy with the, uh, the clip there. Just take out their exit route. Force them to fight you when they're already weak. And you get pretty much a guaranteed kill. This is warded. It doesn't appear to be. So I'm going to go for the second drake here. And second dragon is pretty potent now that they changed it. So hopefully we can snag this. Let's go and sip on our potions. And we should be able to get this. And it looks like we're going to take bot turret as well. So two for one special. Nice. Got it. Good, good, good. That is some good gen... What am I trying to say? Generated gold there for the whole team. I don't know why I couldn't say generated. Alright, let's go ahead and pick up a red buff. And we will go base for the Crystal Scepter. Definitely going to need that soft CC in these fights here. Will be a big help to us. Alright, do I want to build Landry still? Probably. Alright, we're out. We're out. We're not, we're not fighting. That guy's level 14. That's insane. Alright, let's go ahead and pick up the blasting wand component of the crystal scepter. Damn, that guy is huge. Level 14. We have the same farm. He just, I don't know where all that XP came from. Maybe just hell attacks or something. It's crazy. My phone is, why is on a crazy phone? Who's trying to talk to me? I ain't in the mood for talking. All right, let's go ahead and roast some of these wolves. And Vygar showing up, bot lane, Teemo teleporting. Probably not gonna do a damn thing, to be honest. I don't see that being too useful for the team. 
Alright, making sure I don't get charmed, just so we stay safe. And we'll just collect the wave mid that otherwise would have been missed. Alright, there you go. Please don't die, my friend. Alright, he seems safe enough for now. Let's go ahead and smite this. And, ooh, some action going down bot. Okay, I got the flash. Not bad. Alright, Ari, ooh. Oh, you need to, you need to base. You are playing with fire, and you ain't playing with me. I'm so worried for my whole team. I feel like we're overextending. Oh, Corky's dead. Didn't see that one coming. I thought that should be a red buff. Uh, I would rotate mid, but it's probably already gonna die if she commits to it. So I'm just gonna take blue. Oh, she's actually committing to it still. All right. Got blue buff, easy peasy, let's go ahead and cover mid. Kha'Zix shows bottom, so they're not doing anything too crazy. Alright, just kicking mid. Well, that's pretty apparent. Alright, charm down, we're fine. Kha'Zix shows off to the side, can't really do anything, because we don't have any pressure on the map. I need to engage a fight at the moment. I think that is what we need. But everywhere is so weak. Alright, I'm gonna come bot lane and save the day. That's just probably gonna die. Ooh, barely lives. Alright, can we do anything here? Probably not. I'm gonna ward our flank, make sure we don't get collapsed on by Ari as well as Kha'Zix. Yeah, we're not gonna force this fight. Ezreal has no health. Zero point in forcing that. So we'll just try and save the turret here, and then likely base. I think that's our best option. I'll cover so they don't take the turret. Kha'Zix killing Corky again. Oh man, why is he so far forward with no... Look at the map. There's not a single ward and he's that far forward. That's just bad play out of the Corky. There's almost no excuse for that. Can I kill this guy? He does a lot of damage. Jana's burning from the alt, but uh... Oh, we take out Jana actually. Get the heal out of Lucian. Can that guy finish him off? I could flash for this, but I'm not gonna. Don't know where the rest of them are. So Jana actually cast her alt on top of my alt, and I out damage her alt pretty handedly. So uh... She actually just burnt to death there. <laughs> Let's go ahead and take that lantern to safety. And we'll dip... Uh, no, we won't. I'm gonna try and... What can I farm really quick to try and get that Leandris? If we can get Leandris right now, that'd be so beautiful. We'd have the 1-2 combo of Leandris as well as Crystal Scepter. And that is just really, really potent. Let's go ahead and get rid of this ward just so we don't die to an Ari roam. I'm smiling that. I don't want to lose that. I need all the gold. That hook hit, that would have been pretty prime, but uh... Aw, Kha'Zix, you dirtbag! Taking my jungle. Hopefully, he didn't take all my jungle. I just need one thing. Alright, this should get me enough money. We'll probably have to wait like 50 gold, but that's whatever. I just need the land juice. Okay, we only have to wait 10 gold. That's pretty good. Alright, let's go ahead and base, get that land juice going. Got the combo. And we'll finally pick up the oracles as well that I said I was gonna get forever ago. Red buff spawning soon, have alt up pretty much right now. Let's go ahead and bring it to the bot lane at the moment. Yo, he just dashed in your face and you're gonna let him do that? Yo, get in there, baby. There we go. Hook on John. She's dead. No all on her. Gonna roast her as well. Good stuff. Way too over aggressive by the enemy bot lane there. So gonna make him pay for that. Ari is engaging. I think she did just alt onto yes she did. Onto the Corky, so. You better believe I'm coming for that booty. But I'm on a ward, so she backs off. Something was warded here. Oh, you piece of baloney. It was all diversion. Oh, you wanna bump buglies? Alright, yeah. Oh, not my best all ever. Oh shit, he's still coming for me. Is he gonna kill all of us? <laughs> Fuck his all. We can't see shit. He's gonna kill all of us. No, I thought I'd be able to burn him in time. Uh shit. We need a pink for that guy. We would have killed him easily if we had a pink ward. We just got played, man. 
We just got played. What? What are you talking about, Ezreal? Where have you been? <laughs> Where have you been this entire game? We knew he was hella fed. Alright, let's go ahead and sell our refillable pot so we can have a pink ward, because I need to have a pink ward down to deal with that boy. We have just negative pressure in every single lane. We're all getting pushed in. Teemo's really just Teemo and not doing anything. They got their first dragon. That's kind of unlucky for us as well. Yeah, this is going to be a hella hard game. They're never going to group up. They have no reason to group up because they have just immense split push pressure against our team. And we need to group up eventually because, you know, I'm a rumble. Lucian should die. I'm not even going to bother. Okay, never mind. Good John Alt, but John should die. One of them should die here. So I'm not going to bother uh, over committing. There we go. She shouldn't have her ult up. Uh, I needed that little spike to hit her. Alright. Wow, nothing is up. All my jungle is constantly cleared by Kazix. Alright, let's go ahead and push this. And you're probably taking my blue at the moment too. It's making me hella sad. But I can't really do too much. Alright, Corky picks up the package. Alright, yeah, blue's already gone. Everything's just gone, so... Hey, we have wolves at least. Alright, do we... Do we do the YOLO Baron call? I think we could get away with it. Or we could just lose the game completely. But I think we almost have to do something like that at this point. Uh, not comfortable going 1v1 with the Vigar just yet. Because he could press R and I could just die. But we've got Tito coming in hot as well. I'll pressure the, uh, the Vigar here. He's in the bush. I just hit him with everything. Alright, let's not get hit by the W and we're fine. So he kind of accepted his fate and just fell over. Did not expect him to uh, die so easily. I'm going to put a pink ward down just because I want to have a item slot open for a easily large rod because I have enough gold for it so I want to base and get it. I'm picking up Zonis here. It's pretty essential against the Kha'Zix. We're going to try and stop him from getting Hekka resets on us here. That's a pretty good uh, equalizer but no follow up on it whatsoever. So two members going down. Man, if they could have just lived for like five more seconds and waited for me to get there, that could have been potentially game changing, but uh, jump the gun there. Are they doing... Yeah, stop his bet. Holy... Okay. Well, I'm just gonna go ahead and base real quick and regen some health. <laughs> Fuck that. Alright. There we go. Do not. Do not. Kha'Zix is right there. Do not. Just let her clear that pink cord. <laughs> not worth dying. Alright, can we YOLO Baron is the question. I think we should. YOLO Baron. I'm gonna make the call right now. We're either gonna come back right here right now or we're just gonna straight up lose and fall on our face. But uh, I, I like the call. I think we're gonna go for a YOLO Baron. Alright, I'm started. Let's do it, baby. All or nothing right here. Got the pink ward down in the pit, and we're just burning the sucker alive. We do, you know, we got double. Oh, this is free. Kha'Zix is at Gromp. We got the double 80 carry hitting it up, and uh, let's just go ahead and finish her off here. So, uh, 850 on the smite. Help me out, team, please. Got the Baron. I'm gonna just go ahead and dip. I'm gonna just go ahead and dip. No! <laughs> I got hit over the wall. Fuck! I thought I made the great escape. Yo, if we can keep Baron on half the team, I'd be okay with... Okay, he lived. I think Vigar flashed as well. Just base, yo, just base. Just fucking leave. Fucking leave! If we if we keep Baron on four people... Okay. <sighs> fucking retarded, Teemo! Oh my god. Got baited by a fucking pink ward. <laughs> oh well. Three people have Baron. I'll call Worth. If we don't lose inhibitor turrets, I will call Worth on that. But odds are we might lose an inhib turret. Maybe, maybe not. Maybe we just lose two turrets top, so maybe that's not too worth it overall, but whatever. It definitely could have been very worth had everybody just left. We'd have people up right now to defend these turrets, but uh, people went, ooh. Yo, that's huge. So we lost two turrets, got Baron, and got a shutdown kill at the end of that, so that's not terrible. I mean, that is, uh, 
we'll call that overall a victory because that definitely stalls the game out pretty hard. Let's see if we can start sieging. If we group up, maybe. Kazakh will stop getting, you know, the assassinations that he's been getting the entire game if we just group. I don't need to take that lantern, I'm not going that way. Alright, have our alt up as well. Let's just, let's siege it on down mid, baby. We got a lot of poke on our team. We got me, you got Corky, you got Ezreal on there. Ari's still dead, so let's see if we can take this uh, mid T1 turret here. Kind of bring us back on the objectives. Can't stop, won't stop. That is right, my friend. Alright, calling coming out, not doing hardly anything. And until we get some good poke down, I think we should play it slow. We have no reason to all in. And it's kind of hard to fight in the middle of the lane as a rumble. God damn it, this Kha'Zix. Did he really take this again? <laughs> but yeah, it's, uh, it's not the most ideal fighting spot to be in the middle of the lane as a rumble. It's pretty hard to get a crazy equalizer down, so you always got to be mindful of where you want to fight. Alright, let's go ahead and base, and we'll pick up the Seeker's Arm Guard here. Get that stacked up, get some good armor on us. And once we get that Zonius, that'll be pretty huge. The nice thing is, Kha'Zix doesn't really get any stronger at the moment. I mean, he's godlike, but he can't become more godlike. And we have a lot of room to get a lot of uh, good gold on our team here, especially with Corky just only being two items. Bitch, I saw that coming a mile away. Hopefully she doesn't engage on me. Okay, we're fine. I ain't gonna lose my chickens to you. I lost them 20 times already she got, so I'm not gonna lose them to Ari. Teemo top. Oh, is this the 1v1 we were looking for? He's gonna get rotated on. Yeah, he's fucked. <laughs> Teemo's actually so fucked. He doesn't realize it. Can he just back it up? You don't need to pressure. Okay, we actually, he actually survived. So, God bless America. Yo, engage on it. Hello? Walk up to her. Aw, oh, man. You could have walked up to her and forced a flay or something like that. Okay, we got that ward. Good. At the moment, they're just doing the uh, baloney tri push lane. But uh, we'll be able to easily defend it here. Timo, get out. Corky, do not die on me, baby. Okay, you live. God bless. If any one of us dies right now, it's a huge seam in the. Uh, defense here, so we can't afford to have anybody collapse here. I really want to alt this, but we don't have anyone in great position to follow up. Which is kind of unlucky. I'm looking for a good opportunity, though. Trust me. Let's go ahead and just catch this wave. Ah! Okay, a little bit of damage down, but... You know, we can base. They don't have anything pressed right now, so we can get away with this base. And we do have zoners now. So I feel 20 million times more uh, safe with this pickup. Alright, let's go ahead and get full health. Swap around our items. Alright, we just need to make one catch with a hook or anything like that. You did not just dash in front of me like that, boy! I'm I'm gonna engage on you. I'm gonna just walk it up. So they're kind of chunked for my all. But again, nothing gonna come out of it. No follow-up. Ari all down. We're getting some good alts here. Can we get the catch? Jana disengage. And maybe we pick Jana right here. I slowed her twice. Hopefully the team can follow up. I'm gonna rotate bottom with Corky though, just to make sure we don't get uh, caught by the Kha'Zix. Oh lord. Oh lord. Oh my god, I should've zoned you. I just got hit like a fucking truck. Kha'Zix, Kha'Zix, run! The Kha'Zix cleanup is coming. What did this alt do to me? Holy fuck, 1500 damage. I should have just ulted that, man. Or zoned it. Alright. Hopefully my death won't cost us more than maybe one inhib here. Did he just... Did Ezra just shift in? What? I think he just suicided. Okay, we actually might lose now. They're probably gonna get triple inhib off this with Ezreal dying. That's really unfortunate that uh, he just suicided. Maybe they're not. They definitely should have gotten an inhib. Potentially two off that. Alright, well, I'll take it. God, Teemo's so fucking useless. Tank mode. Don't do it, you're gonna get isolated. Don't do it! 
Okay, maybe do it. Maybe do it. Force the, uh, the jump out of Kha'Zix. Nice. Big cooldown. Big cooldown. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Are we actually doing things? No, nah, there's no way we're doing things. I'm just gonna clear top. Uh... Oh, my. Is he dead? Oh, the shield. Nice. Oh, teleport. Rip. Oh, the flash. He's gonna die, though. And he died. Okay. <laughs> Fuck! Everybody's just engaging on us. Oh, I slowed him. Please finish off the job. Nice! That's big. I'm not surrendering. We're gonna give up bot and hip for sure, but uh, let's not give up anything else. What do we want to build? Maybe we throw in some uh, MR, because they have pretty terrifying Vigar and R. Yeah, we'll pick up an Abyssal Scepter. I like that. Let's go ahead and uh, get rid of these minions. So Baron is spawned, and we did just lose bot in hip, so that's the worst in hip to lose with that. Uh... No way. They're going that deep into our base? They should just be on Baron right now. That's kind of dumb of them. That's uh, not too bad. Ezreal, are you just AFK? I need you, bro. I need you, bro! I thought he was gonna collapse! Holy moly. He was just clearing CS mid lane, I guess. They should have been so punished! They were at our T2 turrets for no reason, but I guess pushing mid lane is more important. So now that I died again, we're probably gonna lose... We're gonna lose something. We're probably gonna lose Baron, and then eventually just bleed out. This is a, this is one of those tough losses, man, where you really just... There's no hope, but you're just stalling the inevitable, and this loss is pretty inevitable. I don't know if I, uh... I feel like I played the best I could, but it's just not carryable. Man. 0-4, 0-7, 2-8. That is, uh, that is tough life. Tough life. Yeah. We're probably just gonna wait to lose here, which really, really sucks. We never once grouped and had a solid 5v5, which, you know. I guess Rumble's pretty reliant. I don't think Rumble Jungle will ever be a thing in solo queue or just you know like normal games because rumble requires so much coordination to play with but it's actually a really really high pick uh band right now in high level competitive play which kind of makes sense to me because it's really easy to you know know your win conditions and where to fight and whatnot but in solo play it's pretty useless like or i guess not useless but uh you can't use them to its full potential just because you've seen where i just physically there's been no great alt opportunities for me, so kind of unlucky. All right, well, can we make a pick right now while they're just chilling? We really need to make a pick, but I'm about to get picked. Actually, that guy's chunked from Baron. All right, we got the Corky package. Let's just make a play, engage. Let's just see if we can do this here on anybody. All right, we're going, oh my God, it's a party. All the sweepers. Alright, I'm just gonna plop down an alt here and see if we can get anything to happen. Cossix isn't here, let's fight. I'm just gonna lay down the law right now. That's actually a pretty good rumble all into a corky package as well. There's one hook on Lucian, but uh, the Cossix, <laughs> we're all dead. <laughs> He's coming in to clean up. I'll, I'll live. Fuck you, team. I'm a dip. Yeah, a little too late. I mean, we should have done that 30 minutes ago and maybe we would have won, but uh... I mean, definitely a close game, but definitely one of those where, like, you probably weren't ever going to win. Just playing behind the entire game. Kind of unlucky. Oh, I wanted to hit him with one thing. Wait, can I kill him with the splash? Check it out. We're going to go for a splash kill. Runic Echo splash kill. Here we go. Oh, shit, I already procced it. Awkward. Yo, die, bitch. No! <laughs> GG. Damn, that was a that was a hard game. I'm definitely I'm seeing some uh, some shining lights though for a competitive Rumble Jungle. Oh man, my team was so poor. And that Cossack was so fit. Let's go ahead and take a look at the damage. Yeah, can't do too much there when we just literally have an awful team comp. We had no pressure on the map. Fuck this useless ass champion. 
It doesn't do she. Mm. I'm just kidding. If you like the video, go and throw a like. I'll have all my other social media, such as Twitch, Twitter, and Facebook, as well as in Smash Trees in the info box below. And as always, guys, I will see you all next time.